Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Chris, and of course, this is my channel, Barnon 11970 Thank you, as always, for checking out my video. I basically wanted to take this opportunity to uh, thank all of you and uh, wish you a happy Thanksgiving. And um, basically, those that come to this channel pretty much know what Thanksgiving is all about. And it didn't necessarily start out the way we were told, but that doesn't mean that we can't make it into something beautiful kind and loving you can't change the past and what other people did but you can control present and our future so to me i want to take this opportunity to say how thankful i am for everything in my life good and bad the good obviously are things that we appreciate the bad are actually things that help us learn and grow if we focus and pay attention to them so this is what I want from some of any of my subscribers who care. This is a day almost kind of gluttonous in a way where family get together, they give thanks, and then they basically overeat. If you have any extra food left over, like any canned food that hasn't been opened or any unopened material and any unopened food, instead of just throwing it out, instead of, you know, saying, oh, well, I'll force myself to eat more find a homeless person or a shelter or something and donate that food. Um, as, as nice as it is that somebody can dial a number or enter a computer screen and type in a credit card and give some organization money, we know that that money doesn't all 100% go to where you think it's going to go. But donating something like food for somebody that needs it is going to make their world a better place. Um, unfortunately, we take advantage of people sometimes or take them for granted is probably the better word and we don't understand that because we're all connected hurting one person hurts us all in the long run so if we can do something kind for somebody just because of you know like they say for goodness sake that can change a person's whole life so if you have that ability please help somebody in need because especially on a day like this holidays tend to bring out the best in some and it can be very sad for some you know i've spent holidays by myself so i know what it's like and any of you out there that don't have family or not near family or had arguments with your family first of all let me tell you something coming from a situation where um i took for granted that my father would always be there um, he moved away 20 years ago and we hardly ever spoke and then when he moved back here back in 2012 I only saw him once and he lived three minutes away from me and that was because he came to one of my um, karaoke nights and he ended up dying in a fire and I regret that to this day that I didn't spend more time with him we all take things for granted so if you're if you're in some kind of family feud it's not worth it be the better person if it's something that you can forgive and just appreciate the family that you have if they're gone trust me i know what that's like just know that they're always going to be looking out for you and you're the reason that inspired them to do everything that they've done so if you are by yourself today just know that it's all right. Just know that you could still be thankful for the fact that for the world and the universe to be perfect, you have to be in it. So without you, there is no perfection. There is no infinite. There is no everything. So no matter how bad it gets, and trust me, I know what it's like to have bad times. I am not exactly living the life of luxury where somebody watches my channel and says, boy, I wish I was him. But that doesn't mean you can't do good. You can't turn your life around. You can't say, well, things are bad. What can I do to make things better? What is it about my situation that is making me see negativity all the time? Because you get what you give sometimes. And sometimes it's a learning lesson. So if you're by yourself today, don't feel sad. Just see it as an opportunity to say, you know what? I'm going to use this time to think about myself and what I can do to make the world a better place. Not because I have to, because I want to. And if you start giving, 
and you start helping other people and you start bringing smiles and you start bringing inspiration and you help somebody that no one cared about, all of a sudden you're going to realize that you do have self-worth. And that's one of the things I love about this channel, despite all the hate that I've gotten, all the hate I will get, is the fact that I know I've changed people's lives for the better. Not everybody, because I can't do that for everyone. But a few people here and there will come and tell me that I've helped turn their life around for the better. And that means I have created good in this world. So despite the bad that comes to me, it would be easy for me to just shut down and just not do anything because it's easier. It's very easy to hate. It's very easy to do nothing. But it's, it takes effort and challenge and heart and courage and strength to go and say, you know what, despite all the hatred and all the negativity and all the pain and all the heartache that I've dealt with, that I could still go out and do things for others. And I don't mean me when I say that. I mean, as you saying it for yourself, consider it a challenge. So if you're working today, trust me, I've been there. I used to work for the airlines. I've worked Christmas Day, so I know what that's like. So obviously, if you're at a place where you have to work, obviously you, you might be in a very important place where you need to be there. You know, especially if you work at a hospital, people are counting on you and you're helping to save lives. So sometimes we all make those sacrifices. So be thankful. Find something today to be thankful for. It's not always easy. I know that. But nothing in life worth having ever ends up being easy because it takes effort to show that it's worth achieving. And you can do it. You just have to motivate yourself to know that you have that ability. You just got to want to do it. So don't see this day or any other holiday or any day as a day to be depressed, sad, angry, confused. See it as an opportunity to say, okay, here's a challenge that life has presented to me. What can I do to make the best out of this situation so I can change the way I feel at this moment? Because nothing can do that and no one can do that other than you. And sometimes the world will say, oh, you think you're a happy person? You think you're a generous person? You think you're a kind person? Let's see if it's an honest interpretation of who you are. We're going to bombard you with negativity and challenges because everybody can smile when they're happy. But can you smile when things are at their worst? And that is the true test of inner strength and true strength. And you can do it. So to those of you out there who may be by themselves today or may be feeling down or angry or whatever, find something to be thankful for and use that as motivation from here on out that you decided that today was the day you no longer want to sit around feeling sorry for yourself. Because how are you creating a better world if you cannot even create a better you? So that's up to you, and I hope you do that. So again, I want to thank each and every one of you. I know this video is not going to get 5 million views. I know it's not going to have 5 million shares. I know the world isn't going to all of a sudden say, oh, because Barnon said this, we need a better place. But if I get one or two people and they change their life, something good happened. So thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy your day. Be safe. Please, if you're drinking, just don't drive. It's not worth it. Love your family, love your friends, and most importantly, love yourself. Thanks for watching, guys. Happy Thanksgiving. Peace.